Hello everybody, Eric M and Twins28 here, and I, as promised in the last video I did, the update video, I said I was going to give you guys a little video of my personal wish list of what I'd like to see in MLB The Show 19, which is coming out, I believe, the end of March. I think it's March 26th, and um, I, got a, I got a small list. I'm not really... <clears throat> picky on what I want. Most of what I want, actually everything of what I what would like to see in the game, is in franchise mode because I don't touch Diamond Dynasty. I could care less about Diamond Dynasty. And I don't really don't play Road to the Show that much. So, here's the these are the big things. Ooh, nice hit by Nick Gordon. These are some of the bigger things I'd like to see in added to the game this year. And you have to forgive me for pausing here and there. I commented on another YouTuber's video of what I'd like to see. So I have to go back to that reference to talk on this one. Uh, I think the biggest thing for me personally is I'd like to see expanded rosters. Um, you know, in this version of MLB The Show that I'm playing right now, we have 25-man rosters for the Major League Club, uh, the AAA Club, and the AA Club. Well, we don't have full rosters for the single leg club. And we can't play games with the single leg club. We can put players on the single leg club, which makes no sense because you can only put like so many players on that club. I think they should expand that and allow players to have a tw full 25 man roster for single A. And we should be allowed to play those games. Ooh, he's going to score. Yeah, nice. Um, with that said, comes my second uh, thing I'd like to see is more options for stadiums in the minor leagues. Um, you know, they have the same boring stadiums they always do for the minor league teams. And they're always made up teams. They're always made up stadiums, too. Wagon Man Stadium, Blue... River Stadium, whatever it is. Um, why can't they have the real minor league stadiums like the actual minors, like Frontier Field for the Rochester Red Wings? Um, or add some of those. That would be something I'd like to see too. Um, and as far as stadiums are concerned, more classic stadiums. The ones we usually get you know, some of them are pretty good, the ones from way back. But there's some that have no business being there. I mean, the Metrodome is not a classic stadium. I'm sorry. Yeah, there was the Twins won the two World Series in the Metrodome, but it's not a classic stadium. It was only like 20-some years old when they tore it down. So they need to kind of, I think they should redo the stadium, classic stadium thing. They add some new ones, maybe take some older ones out that shouldn't really be there. You know, and my opinion, stadiums like Tiger Stadium, in Detroit, you know, the old Met in Bloomington, Minnesota, where the Twins first played. Um, County Stadium in Milwaukee, old Comiskey Park in Chicago, stadiums like that, those should be added to the game for classic stadiums. So that's something I wouldn't mind seeing in the game added. Oh boy. Oh, oh, base hit, nice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell was he doing? Okay, so, um... So, stadiums, uh, minor leagues. Okay, here's my last thing I would like to see. There might be some other ones, too. Uh, better options for co hiring coaches, including hiring former players. Um, some of the coaching options, hiring options, are kind of a joke. And... I'd like to see it... Better selection of coaches to to pick from. Um, I wouldn't mind hiring former players who have retired or just retired. That'd be nice. You know, like, I'll give you an example. Joe Maurer. He just retired from the Twins. And just gave up two run homer. Nice job, Snow. Oh, uh, and he just tied it. Of course. I would like to see the option to sign a player who just retired to become a coach. I think that would be great. I'd love to get Maurer down into double A and coach them or single A. 
Uh, that would be a great option to have. Uh, or a former player who's hasn't played in a long time, like Torrey Hunter or somebody like that. Um, so I just think that would be a great thing. And I'd also like the chance to steal a coach away from another team. That would be kind of cool too. So I, that's just some of the things I'd like to see done. And maybe I'll overhaul the free agent system. It's not bad, but it could be better, I'm sure. Um, maybe when you're in free agency and you're going after a player, say, for, sh for shits and giggles, you're going after Paul Goldschmidt, and you offer him a shitload of money, and then all of a sudden, a few days later, it says he's no longer interested in with you, and then he signs with the, another team. They should just, they should change it so they say, such and such team has outbid you. Would you like to put in another bid for so and so? They need to rehaul over uh, the system for that and fix that. So that's kind of some of the things I'd like to see added to MLB The Show 19. And hopefully it comes, hopefully those are things that are in the game, but I doubt it. Um, so what are some things you guys would like to see in added to the game? Leave a comment below and uh, Let's see what everybody thinks should be added to the game. So that's pretty much it for this. Just my personal opinion on stuff that should be added. Ooh, laser shot. So if you like this episode, short episode, vlog, whatever you want to call it, hit that like button, leave a comment if you like, subscribe to my channel, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Until next time, peace out.